on behalf of Asian American Focus, I'd like to welcome you to Miami or, um, and for a wonderful show and a wonderful performance. I'd like to congratulate you. Um, tell me, how did you get started into singing and um, what led you to start a career in singing? Um, I've always been very interested in music, especially I used to watch a lot of Indian films and uh, I copied the songs I used to see on the films and my father had the cassette and I started singing in local functions and it just sort of snowballed from there. Um, you escalated from going from singing to acting into uh, dramas and movies. Tell us about that change and, and how it affects you now. Um, well, I was offered uh, the film when I was still in London. Um, I was doing a show there, I was singing in the show, and uh, I accepted straight away because it was a wonderful story and it's been a great experience. And after receiving that offer, I was offered a drama, and I worked in that for about a year, and it was I had a lot of fun. Tell me, um, if you can briefly, for our audience here, what's the difference between a drama and, and film acting? I think uh, some people say that dramas are more demanding, but I think also films are very demanding because um, there's a lot more pressure to do everything in one take because the reel is more expensive and uh, you get the dialogues while you're standing there on the set about five minutes before you go on. So I think it's a lot more difficult. In dramas, they tend to, um, they can reshoot and they're using two cameras, you know, so it's, it's a bit more, it's a bit less pressure, I think, in television. Um, you, there's about 15 uh, different um, sets to the to your drama. Do you feel that you become part of the character as you are acting it out, or can you just leave yourself and the character apart? I don't, it's it's very difficult. It's my first acting experience, <coughs> and uh, the role was someone who's very similar to myself, <laughs> you know, just a girl who was studying and uh, <coughs> she became involved in social work. So it wasn't, to be honest, it wasn't that demanding. But I think the role in the film that I've had has been more demanding because it's uh, the story of a girl who has everything, but she feels she doesn't have her own identity. You know, it's, it's very interesting. At any point, do you think that you need to incorporate that kind of a character into your daily routine so that you will get more of a feel for it when you go and shoot for the film? No, I don't think so. I think uh, if, if, you, if you become over-obsessed with it, then you're just going to get your own detentions. You just you go to the set and uh, you just do everything there and prepare yourself there. Um, I also understand you've done the playback singing for the, for the movie that you're coming out in. Is, is that something you wanted to do? You wanted to play back as well as act in the movie? Or is it just something just that came up? I would rather, if it came between doing playback and acting, I'd, I'd rather have done the playback. You know, I was, singing is my first interest. So I was very, very happy to do the playback singing, and I'm very excited about the release of the film. Um, who else is starring with you in the film? The hero of the film is Moin Akhtar, who's playing the role of Mr. K2. And the top stars of Pakistan, Rubi Niazi, Shafi Muhammad, Ibrahim Nafis, Shukila Siddiqui. A very, very long cast. Um, during the filming of this film, uh, did any particular memories that s stand out that, that you'll uh, keep on as being part of your first film that you, that you made? I don't think there's anything in particular. Everything was a lot of fun, but <laughs> there's a lot of delays <laughs> on the shooting. It took a lot of time because... Uh, the directors were looking for perfection, so if something wasn't right, it was done again. And if it wasn't right, then it was done again. So we've come up with a perfect film. It's really very good. Well, we'll definitely be looking forward to seeing you in that, Thank and um, we appreciate you doing this interview with us. And hopefully we'll see you again in Miami. I hope so. Thank you. Thank you.